<laughs> so tired. people of the world so um, let's talk <laughs> so for the past couple of weeks um, my workouts have been pretty consistent um, been working out at least four to five days a week I've been doing two leg days two upper body days and then trying to get in like an ab cardio full body kind of day I feel like I'm getting stronger as I should be um, I'm progressively moving up my weight uh, about five pounds to ten pounds if I could push it a week yeah I'm pretty glad that um, I can see the progression like it's not just sticking at the same weight across the board I'm actually pushing up my weight every week so that's pretty good but I am a little annoyed because my weight on the scale is going up as well but yeah um, I'm usually about 116 to 117 pounds but I'm pretty sure it has gone up so, I'm going to take you guys to the scale and we will see together how much more I've gained. The last time I weighed myself, I had just hit 120. And just for reference, I'm 5'1", so I'm pretty short. So being anything past <clears throat> 120 or around 120, it gets me a little bit... <sighs> Anyway, let's go see how much I'm weighing today. As you guys saw, I am at 122 pounds currently. Um, I've never been over 120 pounds. In high school, my max weight was 120 pounds. I was pretty thick, um, chubs, whatever you want to call it. So it kind of made me, like it, it made my emotions go all out of whack. Seeing <laughs> the number on the scale be more than I've ever weighed. After a day or so of sulking in my fatness, <laughs> I decided to snap out of it and actually evaluate what might actually be going on with my body. So, let's take a look. Now, I don't think that I look anywhere near as chubby as I used to look in high school my body seems like decent like there's <laughs> it's not terrible you know it, I'm not looking like a slob my muscles I really don't see much definition so here's my theory along with um, my vigorous workout routine I have also been eating tons of garbage. I've definitely been snacking hardcore and I haven't really been beating myself up over it because I figure as long as I'm continuing to push it at the gym, um, keeping my water intake high and not eating crazy, crazy fatty foods like I don't eat takeout or chain restaurants like Burger King, McDonald's, things like that. I avoid all of those, but <coughs> I will get a burger every now and then. I will eat 
cookies, um, ice cream, all the good stuff. Oh my god! Fucking the train, sorry. Okay, um, yeah, you guys know how bad I am when it comes to snacking. But, I think the reason why I don't look terrible, but my weight is going up, is because I'm gaining muscle, which weighs more than fat. I'm also gaining fat, which is just extra weight, <laughs> and a ton of water retention. Um, I haven't been drinking water as much as I need to, but I definitely used to drink way more water. Yeah, I saw... <laughs> A video going around on Facebook about some lady that tested out different bottled waters and their pH balance and all that stuff and I realized that the water I drink has a pH of about five so that completely threw me off and I haven't been drinking enough water because we have like a Poland spring cooler in our house so I've been avoiding that and only trying to buy Fiji water because that is kind of neutral it's about like seven 7.4 something like that anyway I digress so I think the cause of my weight gain is due to water retention fat gain and muscle gain all together and and although I really wanted to like be down in the dumps and beat myself up over it I realized that the number on the scale does not really matter. It's all about what you're doing, what you're putting into your body, and being consistent. So, I just wanted to make this little video to let you guys know if you're doing, um, you know, weightlifting or exercising and things like that, as long as your physique seems to look all right there must be something else contributing to the weight gain. So don't just look at the number on the scale like, oh my god, I'm 122 pounds of fat. No, that's what I initially did. Don't get me wrong, it freaked me the fuck out. But there's other things that contributed to it as well. You may be gaining muscle, you may be bloating or retaining a lot of water. So you never know like exactly what it is. So if it's not your body fat percentage being accurate, accurately tested by someone, don't freak out. Take a deep breath and just keep back on your grind. <laughs> ah! Guys, you have no idea. I was really, really pissed. I was so angry. I was like, fuck the gym. Fuck this working out shit. It's not even working. I'm just getting fucking fat. But hey, you gotta look back and reevaluate and figure out what it is that you're doing wrong. So, although I don't want to cut out my snacking habits because I'm having a great time, I think I will cut them down by half. Yes. And I definitely need to boost up my water intake for sure. And another factor that may be contributing to this weight gain a lack of cardio I have been avoiding cardio like the plague I get on the treadmill maybe once a week maybe I just ugh. so I'm going to try to incorporate some high intensity routines because about the same concept and not as boring as walking on a treadmill for like 35 plus minutes that's what I need to do in order to see the change in a positive way. <laughs> I hope I'm not rambling too much, guys. Um, this is just a really quick video because I didn't want to skip uploading something this week. I am working on a few things. I asked some people that I have as friends on Facebook if they would be interested in seeing me stream once or twice a week on Twitch. I was thinking of doing a live stream of at-home workouts that anybody can do. Like you can literally tune in and get to work like straight away. No equipment needed. Um, 
yeah i figured maybe people would be into that if you guys think you would be into that please leave a comment below and let me know i'm still working out um like how to use twitch and things like that i know my brother uses it for gaming but i never really used it myself so yes i'm still fidgeting around with that and then i am going to write out a couple weeks worth of programs so that i can have ready for you guys and yeah if that sounds cool please stay tuned i will update you guys here on youtube as soon as i get that going and yeah that's about it i hope you guys are having a wonderful week don't let any negativity bring you down and that's about it I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!